Hey, uh, good evening guys. Uh, today we are going to discuss about uh, the simultaneous equation bias and how this leads to inconsistent and unbiased estimate when we apply OLS to a simultaneous equation model. That we know that uh, the OLS estimate has so many important uh, properties, uh, optimal properties like uh, best, uh, linear unbiased minimum variance and uh, usually they said to be the blue estimate that is best linear unbiased and minimum variance estimate. But uh, when we apply uh, OLS into a simultaneous equation uh, model, uh, it will violate all these uh, properties and uh, one of the important assumptions also violated like uh, there is no covariation between the exogenous variable and the random variable and it finally leads to that OLS estimates are becoming uh, unbiased, sorry, biased and inconsistent result will be the final result of applying OLS into a simultaneous equation model. Let us uh, prove that uh, how this is happening in a simultaneous equation model uh, when we are applying OLS procedure. That in a simultaneous equation model, for example, a Keynesian uh, consumption function income determination model, Ct is equal to alpha plus beta y t plus ut is a uh, consumption function where consumption is a function of income and uh, income uh, is equal to CT plus uh, IT. It's a Keynesian consumption uh, income determination model. And in this uh, simultaneous equation model, there is a co-way, uh, co uh, there is a two-way cause and effect uh, relation existing between CT and YT because in the first equation CT depends on YT and in the second equation YT depends on CT. Because of this uh, simultaneous uh, relation, one of the important uh, assumptions of CLMRM is uh, violated. That is, uh, covariation between the exogenous variable yt and ut is equal to zero. That is one of the assumptions of CLRM that is violated, and uh, there exists a strong correlation between yt and uh, ut. When we prove the uh, OLS estimate, that is, beta hat is a best linear unbiased estimate. Uh, uh, first, we can prove that beta hat is an unbiased estimate when we take the equation that is beta hat is equal to beta plus uh, sigma wi ui. Then, uh, when we apply uh, expected value of beta hat, that is equal to beta plus expectation is assigned to the relation between sigma wi and ui. And we know that uh, uh, wi in this equation is equal to uh, sigma yi ui whole divided by sigma yi square. And we already proved that covariance of yt and ut is not equal to 0. Therefore, this equation may not be equal to uh, 0. Therefore, the expectation of beta hat is equal to beta plus something exists because this term will never vanish and the, that, that uh, term itself showing a strong uh, correlated uh, uh, coefficient is there, uh, there is existing and uh, th that is because of that beta expectation of beta hat is be equal to beta plus uh, something some positive quantity will be remain or uh, some quantity is there existing in, in this equation therefore uh, in order to prove that beta hat is a, a, a true estimate of beta we have to reduce as uh, expectation of beta must be equal to the true value of the original population parameter but here in simultaneous equation model uh, the expected value of beta hat will is equal to or it will give you uh, some uh, biased and inconsistent result because uh, it includes beta plus something there in the equation therefore uh, the important assumption is violated in uh, simultaneous equation model